Lead me by the hand and help me face the rising sun. Comfort me through all the pain that life may bring. There's no other hope that I can lean upon. Lead me, Lord. Lead me all my life. Hello, I'm Connie Accurso. My husband Steve and I have been longtime members of St. Vincent de Paul. I'm Ron Nicholas, and my wife Barbara and I are newcomers. Ron and I are here to talk to you today about small Christian communities at St. Vincent de Paul. Let me begin with a little bit about the history. It began around 2005 when several parishioners began to discuss their wonderful experiences with small Christian communities in their previous parishes. They decided to start a ministry here, and with the beginning of one group of interested parishioners, our SCC was born. Ron, do you realize that with the help of the Holy Spirit, our ministry has grown to include over 200 parishioners in more than 24 communities as of this year, 2019? I am not surprised because the Holy Spirit was answering our prayers as new members of St. Vincent de Paul when we were seeking an opportunity to become closer to our community. We have learned in life how important community is to the betterment of our faith journey. We have found that in SCC. Why don't you describe what SCC is? I would love to. We are small, faith-sharing communities in which we focus our discussions on the upcoming Sunday's liturgical readings with emphasis on the gospel message why do you focus on the gospel message? That is an important aspect of our SCC. You know, it's certainly not a new concept. After all, St. Paul addressed the early followers of Christ gathered in small groups over 2,000 years ago. Also, we know that St. Pope John Paul II was a strong advocate of small Christian communities. He stated in 1999 that it was urgent for large parishes to form small communities so that human relationships could form in the light of the Word of God. Human relationships formed in the light of the Word of God. So this is not a Bible study. No, whereas a Bible study is meant to scholastically enhance your understanding of the Bible, SCC is not a Bible study. Instead, it is meant to enhance our faith by sharing God's work in our lives with a small group of people using the next Sunday's readings as the foundation of our discussion. Tell us how that's working in your community, Ron. Sure. It is working well. We meet in each member's home on a rotating basis at least twice each month for about two hours. Groups generally have eight to twelve members but we have 10 in our community. By sharing together every couple of weeks, we have developed love, appreciation, and respect for each other. Using the readings for the following Sunday as a basis for our discussions, and by praying and sharing together, we have developed a growing understanding for how God has worked and is working in each of our lives to bring us spiritually closer to Him. I think it's very important for people to know that confidentiality is a byproduct of the respect you develop for each other as is your commitments to attend and support each other. By attending SCC, our large parish feels more like our own community because we get to know other parishioners on both a deeper spiritual and more personal level. Also. We have found help for the lesson formats and commentaries provided on each of the readings, and they include pertinent questions to help facilitate group discussion. And of course, somehow, we do find time to socialize and play together, thus enjoying the fruits of God's grace. Come, Come join, join us. us. You can experience this wonderful faith journey with us. Look for contact information on the Faith Formation page of the Sunday Bulletin. Lead me by the hand and help me face the rising sun. Comfort